Hi, my name is Cherry and I will be reviewing skincare and makeup products from Orkless. But first, you gotta drink water because it's hot. So the first product is the Love Nature Body and Hair Oil. My hair is damaged because of so much bleaching and other chemical products that I put into it. So I use this oil to easily brush them. Next is the Love Nature Refreshing Toner. I love this one because it smells like bubblegum. Grab a piece of cotton, put a few drops in, and then apply it to your face. Next is the HydroCare Soothing Night Cream for dry and sensitive skin. This is perfect for me because my skin tends to be super dry sometimes. It has a pinkish tone and blends easily. There is also Hydra Radiance Hydrating Day Cream for normal or combination skin. This one has a bluish tone and more runny than the other. Next is the HydroCare Comforting Day Cream for dry and sensitive skin. This one is a little hard to blend or did I just put too much? These are the mattifying face lotion for oily skin and hydrating face cream for normal skin. I forgot to show it but I'm using the HydroCare Comforting Day Cream for dry and sensitive skin. Next is the Love Nature Refreshing Eye Gel for normal skin. It is transparent and feels cool when applied. This is the Hydra Seeing is Believing Eye Cream for all skin types. In here, I am using the Seeing is Believing eye cream. When applying it, you should just lightly tap because this is the most sensitive part of our face. Now that we've finished the skincare part, we'll now move on to the makeup. This is the BB cream on color with SPF 10 and the shade Fair.
Next is the Giordani Gold Bronzing Pearls in Matte Bronze. Next is this makeup palette. This is called The One and it's already a 5-in-1. It consists of eyeshadow, blush, powder, highlighter, and bronzer. The mascara that I will be using is the One Tremendous Tears Mascara. I don't know how to do my eyebrows so I just applied simple castor oil to it. For blush, I am again using the One Makeup Palette. For the highlighter, the shine is there but you can't really see it well on cam.
forgot about the lashes, but this is the one magnetic lash and eyeliner kit. And I struggle. Yeah. As you can see, it has magnet in it. So to apply, you have to draw your eyeliner first. I don't know how to draw mine. I've been practicing best. I've been practicing how to do them, but I still don't get it. After drawing your eyeliner, you just now have to stick the lashes to your eyeliner. I didn't get it right because I don't know how to draw mine properly. But you get it now. Yes, that's what you have to do to apply it. And that's it. Thank you for watching. Please like and subscribe to my mother's YouTube channel. Goodbye.